I'm a teen librarian at Manchester City Library. I'm here to talk to you about a nominee for the Flume Award, which is a New Hampshire Book Award for teens in grades 9 to 12. This nominee is for the 2021 award, which means you have until April 2021 to read the nominees and vote for your favorite. So the book I'm going to talk to you about is Unpregnant, and that's by Jenny Hendricks and Ted Kaplan. And as you might guess from the title, as well as the pregnancy test with the bleeped out curse word, um, this book has to do with abortion. It's also a hilarious road trip novel, and it was chosen by us as one of the best books of 2019. So I hope you stick with me as I read to you from the publisher's description so you get an idea for what it's about. And then I'm going to tell you why I love this book. So here we go. 17-year-old Veronica Clark never thought she'd find herself holding a thick piece of plastic and staring at two solid pink lines. How her boyfriend managed to get her pregnant, even with the most consistent use of condoms, is a mystery. But the, with a promising college-bound future now disappearing before her eyes, Veronica considers a decision she never imagined she'd have to make, an abortion. There's just one catch. The closest place to legally get one is over 900 miles away in New Mexico, and Veronica doesn't have a car. Desperate, she turns to the only person she believes won't judge her, Bailey Butler, a legendary misfit at Jefferson High, and Veronica's ex-best friend. The plan is straightforward. A 14-hour drive to the clinic, three hours for the appointment, and a 14-hour drive home. What could go wrong? Not much, apart from three days of stolen cars, shotguns, crazed ex-boyfriends, kind-hearted truck stop strippers, ferret napping, aliens, and the pain and betrayal of a broken friendship that can't be outrun. Soon Veronica must risk everything to repair the hurt she's caused. Under the vast starlit skies of the American Southwest, Veronica and Bailey discover the road to adulthood isn't easy but it's better with a friend by your side. So what I love about this book is it is legit funny. Um, it's laugh out loud funny. Um, it's a road trip story. It's actually measured in miles. Um, each chapter, the first one starts with mile zero and the last one ends with mile 2012. So it is a long road trip. Um, I like that the story is about healing. Um, Veronica and Bailey's friendship uh, had a really tough breakup earlier before the book started. And um, it's a real struggle for them along the way, but they do manage to come together and be there for each other when they need it. Uh, the abortion in the book is treated very matter-of-factly, um, and it's obviously central to the story, but it's not the most important thing. It's more about the um, adventures along the way and the healing of the friendship. So that's what I love about this book, and I hope you'll give it a try, as well as the other nominees on the list. Thanks for listening.